Hello guys, how are you? My name is Diana Munoz and welcome to this tutorial. In today's video, we are going to learn how to create lines in Canva and also how to make them thin, how to make them thicker, or how to change the body of the line, how to make it dotted or how to make it continuous and also how to change the edges of the lines. So I'm really excited to show you this new feature. So are you ready? Let's go to my computer. Okay, so here we are in this design. This is actually one of Canva's templates and uh, I'm going to show you first the two ways in which you can create a line in Canva. So the first one, the easiest one, I will say, is just to type the key L. So you go to your keyboard and type L. Yeah, <laughs> here we have our line. Maybe you cannot see it pretty well because it's a dark line, but let's change the color. Let's uh, use this white. And let's go and use the second way to create a line in Canva. So we can go to the element section, the element category on the left hand side. And here we have these lines category. So we see all and we can select any of these. So the new feature in Canva, if you pay attention at the beginning of this video, here I'm going to change the color, but next to this color button we have four different options which we didn't have before so in here we can actually change the weight of our lines we can make them thicker or we can make them really really thin as like one pixel thin so we can actually do this super fast before we used to have like all these tricks and like walk arounds but now we have it with just one click and then we can actually also change the style of our lines so we can have two different styles of continuous line let me just change the weight of this line so you can see better and let me go closer to the design so okay so here we have the first style no actually the second one let's go to the first one and let's pay attention to the end of the line. So this one is straight cut of the line. It's really, it looks kind of like a, a rectangle, very uh, straight. And the second option, you will see that it is rounded. So now our line, it looks, uh, it may be like a button. If we make it thicker, we can actually create buttons like this if we wish. And then we have, let's go to a regular <laughs> line size. And then we have these two other options, which are dotted options, like dotted styles. So here we have a discontinuous line, I would say a broken line. And then we have this uh, line made out of just dots. So here we have all our different styles. And then finally, let me go to the continuous line. Finally, we have these two other options in which we can add a beginning of the line and an end of the line. So we can use any of these shapes. Let's use this um, shape for the beginning of the line. You will see that here we have now this little shape. And then at the end, let's use an arrow. Why not? So like that we start to have a different vibe or different style on our design. Just with one line, we can actually make it smaller, maybe position the line here, just right below barbershop. We can actually change this other end of the line to make it more symmetric. And there you have, so you can actually maybe leave the design like this, or I'm just going to show you. Let me just create a different page and let's create a different style with just different lines. So let's delete or remove the ends of the lines and make a dotted line and just duplicate it and put it on top of the design. So here we already have two different styles. We can actually also let's delete this line and let's add a different one 
so we can change the weight make them even like really really small really thin and we can also change the ends maybe let's use the round or the circular end and there you have a different style so you can actually play around with all these different styles of lines and have different designs different vibes different styles so this is it and i really hope you enjoyed this video if you create a new design using this new feature in canva let me know just tag me on any instagram post that you create or you can send me a dm and as always i'm going to recommend you guys some videos right here if you want to learn more about canva and if you want to try canva pro for free for 45 days i'm going to leave a link here so you can enjoy canva that's 15 days more than what you will find on canva's website so that's it i guess i see you in the next tutorial bye